This is Andrew Keen from Trading Nation. Today we're gonna look at Disney and with earnings coming up, I think Disney's headed for a move higher. Let's look at here first on the daily chart. On the daily chart, we see this clear bear channel to the downside. However, we do see consolidation here around the $90 level. I think that's gonna act as support for us. Here, same thing on the weekly chart, down here, but $90 got a support. I want to take a longer term trade in Disney. I think Disney has been oversold and I think it's going to head back to the $100 level that we saw in July, trading up to 104 in May. I don't think it's going to be that high, but it has a measured move target to $100 by January. Look at the weekly chart. You know, weekly chart gets it to above 100, maybe 105. So we saw a lot of resistance at 100, but this is where I think it's headed in January. My trade is simple and easy. It's buying the January 97.5. 100 bull call spread. I buy the 97 and a halfs, I sell the 100s, I can do this for 50 cent debit. Very similar trade to one I did in Microsoft, okay? Longer term trade, you know, if it does sell off on earnings, I still think it can go higher um, until January. Do this for 50 cent debit on this trade, risking $50. If it goes to my measured move target of $100 by January, that spread can go from 50 cents to $2.50 five times my money. So my trade buying the Disney January 97 and a half 100 bull call spread for 50 cent debit. This is Andrew Keen from Trading Nation. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.